I guess we lose. We did. Free of that blasted tower. Yeah, we did. I'll let you guys see what the combo is while I get some water. <laughs> oh, actually, let's stick around for this. How much is this doing to me? Oh, we're not dead. Hold on. This doesn't necessarily kill us, does it? I mean, it, because we've got so many large green men. Also, the opponent's taking fatigue damage. That's a pretty cool animation. And to think I almost left. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> uh, all right, now I'll be back. That was <laughs> Watch this. Your soul shall be mine. Watch your back. Doctor Doctor. I hope this opponent is running deranged doctor in their deck. Oof, we've just got the big boy curve. Raffle, if we quit your misplays, we just show off your entire stream. That's that's a fair point. Like <laughs> that's You got me there. Alright, the sap has gotta be good in this matchup, right? Three mana is what? Death Lord, okay. So it's probably Reno then. That's a five drop. We're good. I'm not too concerned about the only card that matters is Nizoth getting pulled out of this. That would be a bummer. Hey, Roustrich. Is it worth the 2-2 here? I think I want the weapon more. I can heal later, so I'm not too concerned about that. But like playing the Shrook in there just makes the Defile a lot better. Uh, I actually haven't played the Tavern Brawl just yet, so I don't have a good deck. Somebody in chat might though. Okay, just don't hit the Nazoth. Please don't hit the Nazoth. Okay, we get the Shadow Step and if it's Nazoth, so that's perfect. I'm gonna kill this off and take some more face damage. I would have liked it to be Bran, but that's okay too. I'm gonna save the uh, the shadow. Like I just want to get as many Nazoths as possible this game. I think that's how I win. So save a Tog scheme and save the Shadow Step for Nazoth. We should be able to outvalue Reno Mage, Reno Warlock. Especially with this, I mean, we just might be able to out aggro them. I've got lethal set up, don't I? Not anymore. I should kill that though, so I just attack dagger. What if I did this instead? This is five. So this makes a five, I get... Deals two damage. There's no Godfrey. There's no twist this turn, so I think I want to do this instead. So yeah, so we play the Loth of the turn we could potentially set up for, uh, for Nether. Maybe I should have uh, left the Reno? The, the concern was like Zola, which isn't that concerning given that we're just like going to kill them on a single turn, but...
But yeah, I think the low thud for sure is better blocking the twisting nether. I think we win from here. There's no one mana pot that... that well, was a actually one mana, two damage AoE into Defile full clears. Unlucky. So there's no lethal, but... It's effective. Ah, uh, that's lethal. Here we go. Yeah, you think aggro mirrors are generally harder than control mirrors? Uh, not necessarily. It's not as simple as like archetype versus archetype here. Oversimplifying things just kind of creates unnecessary misconceptions. Cheese did it. Am I dropping frames again? No. I sh doesn't look like I've dropped frames since the last uh, time. Oh, uh, no more. That's a bad draw just because I guess I already going to do that. Okay. I'd like to find a sap. I think just run this out and see if we can make the opponent think about their lives for a bit. Am I considering playing the Tavern Brawl at some point? Uh, probably off stream. I need to at least get a win for my pack, I think. Monkus. Seven damage on board. I don't want to die. Please help, Chet. Just gonna swing this at the face. Set this up to uh, heal for next turn. Seven damage is manageable, right? The, the opponent can't magnetize stuff if there's no board space. So we take nine, and then we get to play the uh, the Kakarot into here or into weapon. Here we go. Just play vanish. Uh, I'd rather not. Just play spreading plague. Yeah, I am Malfurion. Those would both be good in this deck. Uh, this goes off first, so wait. But the reborn doesn't, so that's good. I would like one sap, please. Actually, we're in the same situation, right? Ten. Like we just equip the weapon. We go. Say go. Next turn, I can coin out the Valera. better. The problem with coining out the Valera is that like I maybe just die. Coining out the Valera gives me the opportunity to draw into sap. 10 damage on the board. I heal for 8, 13, 0 power. I don't live is the problem. Right because they, that only gets me to well plus the 5 at 18. Alright let's try it. I'm probably dead here, though. I think the Valera might have been better, but it was close. Does that kill me? Nope. I feel like we should have been dead there. What if I go Valera this turn? Run that in. It sets up another dead turn for the opponent.
It allows us to also coin the Tog scheme so that we don't have to necessarily shadow stuff the Nizoth. I don't want to trade into the bomb because the bomb gives the opponent board space for like a Metal Tooth Leaper or something. If I read Vagabond, um, no. Thanks for the, uh, for the recommendation. I think we're dead. Maybe not, because they seal for six each. Yeah, I think we're fine. I can shadow step the Nizoth the next turn. Just kidding. I wanted to leave that up just so that I had uh, attackers, but... Okay. I guess we're not dead. Uh, but I wanted the extra attacker on Nizoth in case there was a big minion that came down. 